Yo guys, welcome back to another video, and can I just say, we're getting so close to 100 subs now, it's actually insane. So if you are new around here, first time watching my video, then please subscribe, leave a like on this video as well, that does help. The likes are getting more and more now each video, we're hitting around 5, five plus likes now, it's insane. But today, what we are doing is upgrading the Volvo 850R. I have three of these. Mainly from wheel spins, but I thought, you know what, I'm never going to use it stock. It's C Class 564. I'm never going to use it, so we might as well upgrade it. Ooh, you're hard showing off. So, let's just get into this. Engine, we've got all this stuff to upgrade. It's going to take. It's not going to take a while, though, is it? Because we're, we're rapid at this stuff. It is actually four wheel drive. Is actually four wheel drive. Did I just say four wheel drive? I mean, it is actually four. I can't, I can't. It's actually front wheel drive. There we go. Don't know why I was saying four wheel, four. I can't. But yeah, it is actually front wheel drive, so we do need to change that, probably going to put it to all wheel, might lower this, it depends what it looks like, if we can lower it a lot, or might just raise it, and use it as more of an off-roady type car, but at the moment, it, it looks alright, it's not a bad looking car for, from the 1990s, 1997 it is, so yeah, it's not too bad looking in my opinion, those brakes look nice on it as well, now here we can lower it. That lowers it a lot, but I think I'm going to raise it, you know. Not going to bother with anti-roll bars, but weight reduction we will. It is now B-class at the very top. This will take it into A-class, yes, by one. So now we're just doing all this stuff. Just maxing out, really. Now, the rims. Hopefully we can get some good rims and upgrade the size of them a lot. So... I'm not feeling I'm not feeling any gold coloured rims. I'm just gonna stay with these sort of rims. No, I don't know why I picked them there. They're actually disgusting. Who uses those? You only use those rims if you want to ruin a car. That's why these are in this game. I'm gonna go with them. Those yellow rims are so nice. But hopefully we can change the rim size a lot and we can only change it by two, but they go quite Do they actually go? Oh, we can change the back by two as well. I thought it was three left for some reason. But they actually go quite bigger. Now, front bumper. Got a Volvo bumper. Yeah, just why not? We've got a Volvo wing as well, but four's a wing. It's only a small one. Oh, it's just no wing for that. Um, I'm actually gonna... They're so similar, it just adds a little bit on. I'm gonna go with no wing. It just looks better. My opinion now, here we go, engine swap. Hmm. Uh, just doesn't make it good, does it? It just doesn't. Drivetrain swap. Uh, what do we want? I'm feeling all-wheel drive for this car. Take it off-road as well. I also want to go to tyres, tyre compound. By the way, if you notice I'm clicking the same thing twice, it's because my mic's in the way. That, that's why. I need to sort that out. Like that. Oh, God. Ooh, this mic's annoying me. Right. The Horizon ones will look... Yeah, they do look nice on this. We're going to go with them. We could potentially get this... I don't know if we can get this S2. But those thicker tyres do help. I think I might have missed something out on here. Yeah. Nope, I didn't. Okay, so we're going to install this. 59000 it's going to cost. But it's alright, we've got like 3 million, so it's all good. And hopefully this car will look so nice if we find a nice livery for it. Because the liveries are what make a car really nice. Okay, so these are the top liveries. Why is that there? What is that? Pink rims and the rest is black. Rubbish. That's not too bad. A wood design. 
why if it's one star popularity is it the fourth result i don't get that that looks nice but just don't really like that yellow horrible no what does that say imagine all the people living there i don't know um i the, the hat gate <laughs> gay that's nice i think the guy gave up putting the stickers around all the side yeah rocket bunny that looks pretty cool apart from that red bit of the front why has he done that police that police is rubbish design because of the it's all good and then he sticks red police text on it that that's actually quite good looking Okay, so I'm actually feeling a police design for this car. Hopefully there are some nice ones. That's nice. Metropolitan Police. I'm going with that design. And now, our car is complete. I may tune it a little bit. Depends. But yeah, our car is basically complete. And I'm going to take it into some online games and see how well it does. Six and a half hours later. Okay, so we're playing small map at the airstrip. And we're playing king, okay. There are around five people in this lobby, so... Okay, we did not start off with a king, but the guy has got a bowler EXRS. I don't think that's his. I think that's the car you get if you forget to choose a car. So, let's go, and hopefully we can go get this king. And he's right there. And he hasn't got very long in viz. Because it has already run out. And because my mic's in a way, it's going to be quite irritating now. Because I can't see the map. I'm going to have to always... Oh, Aston, okay, brilliant. The Mini has got the King now, and he was in Viz. Let's go, let's hunt this Mini down. Come on, that Mini's going to be nippy through here. Getting through the, oh, he's crashed that. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Yes, he so could have turned there. But he just didn't. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's it for me. The mini's got it back. There's nowhere for me to go. There's an Aston after me. A bowler. A mini. What was that madness? Ah, the Opal's got it off him. But, ah. Don't reverse. Thank you. Because he, if he'd have reversed, he'd have gone straight into me. The second time that Dodge Viper's gone into me now. Seriously? This is good at turning this Volvo as well. We've made a tank of a car here. Move out the way, Aston. Ah, oh, he's gone round. Okay. Okay. Flipped it. That's how you land the flip as well. This guy's over here. Why is he just not gassed it down? Ah, oh, the Mini's got it off him. Could be sneaky again. Yes! That's why you have a big long Volvo as your car. Because it's long. It can always reach out for it. Oh, there's the Opal. Oh, Volvo's looking a bit muddy now. Oh dear, oh dear. It's not good at turning at high speed. Ah, that Viper. Can we get it off him now? No. Keep it in reverse. Go on. All wheel drive helps him massively. Go on, keep going. Now, nah, Opal's going to get it. Where's he coming from? Yes. Just edging into fifth gear there. To get the king. And now we fly. Now we fly. That Opal's right behind me, though. Got to be wary of it. Oh, God. Ah! Ah! It was either the Opal or the Mini. And the Mini got it off me. Oh, and the Bowler's got it off that Mini. Oh yeah, his ghost doesn't last long at all. If he's popping it around here. Oh, who's got it now? The Opal again. The race ends soon. I need it for nine seconds and then I win. Oh, the guy that's... I need to get a beat's got it now. So we're coming in second. Ah, uh, sit for me. Uh, why is that box floating there? What's that? 
And we came in second in that event. Not too bad for the Volvo. A time of 51 minutes. Everyone had the king in that event. Six people and everyone had the king, even if you had it for five seconds, like aching space 50. And we won that event with 660 points. And you can't go wrong there. Volvo 850R beating that list of cars. Look, a Viper, zero points. He didn't even get hold of a flag. That's how bad he did. But we did win, which was very good. And as you can see, this car build was a very good build. It did well in both events we did use it in and... Yeah, it's a very good all-round car. I did want to make this video because I've seen others use it. I was like, it'll be interesting to do a build on this. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new around here. And yeah, peace out.